setup of apps and workforce pro wf4833 open any of the web browser in your pc like google chrome or microsoft edge and enter this website in address bar which is appson.com this web website will open where you just need to scroll down and here you need to select region so i'm going to select usa and then home page will open where you need to hover on support and click on printers and the printer support page will open just scroll down and uh, here you need to choose the printer type so click on all in ones and select the printer series so it is work for series and now select the printer model name and click on it and finally you will find the printer page where you can see its name and image and here you will see downloads tab and under downloads tab you will see various drivers for your printer so this is a recommended driver its name is drivers and utilities combo package installer so we need to download this driver to complete the setup you can see its detail like release date and file size and file name you can click on any driver name and you will find all detail about that for example i have clicked here and you can see description and some other details and compatible systems so i'm going to download it by clicking on download button download has been started here and once it will complete i'm going to launch it by clicking on this arrow icon and then click on open after launching a window will appear and it will ask allow this app to make changes to your device click on yes and later this window will appear to you here you need to click on okay to continue and now file is extracting which was downloaded so driver has been launched now as you can see and uh, it will asking it is asking to accept the license agreement click on accept now click on next now to checking the system requirements here you need to make sure that your printer is powered on and then click on next and now it is downloading required software now we need to complete this setup here you need to select your connection method like wi-fi usb cable or ethernet cable so i'm going to select wi-fi and then click on next now it is checking the system just wait here click on next and now you need to follow these instructions on your printer control panel and then click next here recommended wi-fi you need to select that and then click on next and start setup and then select others wi-fi auto connect proceed with next button and here it is starting Wi-Fi setup so in this way you can follow on screen instructions and uh, complete the setup of your apps and printer and if you face any type of issues you can call us on the given number in this video description or click on the support link